Good morning to you. It is Thursday, August 4th. I'm Teo Torres. Here's a look at the big stories we're following this morning. Well, this morning, a Sacramento family trying to figure out where to go next after their home was destroyed by a fire. But they say they're grateful to be safe. It's thanks in part to a Sacramento County worker who spotted the flames and helped get the kids and the grandmother to safety. Scary moments for two Tahoe women. Watch this video as an SUV crashes into a dispensary in Washoe County. The sheriff's office says an older woman didn't put her SUV in park across the street from this business in Incline Village. A vehicle rolled backward and ended up crossing Highway 28 before smashing into New Leaf Lake Tahoe. And a heads up for drivers in Alpine County, Highway 89 is still closed today, north of Markleyville due to severe flooding there. Crews will be back this morning to assess the damage. We'll be sure to let you know when it opens back up and what the plan is to deal with this mess. Let's get a check on our forecast now. And boy, in that area, it rain came down hard for a time. Yeah, heavy rain was the story there. It could potentially be the story again today. Beyond that, we're also talking about hot conditions again. It's a mild start. We're coming off a widespread triple digits yesterday, so most of us are still holding on to the 70s. In fact, Stockton, just a few minutes ago, you were still at 80 degrees. Here's how it's going to go. Enjoy the morning while we're still mild. We'll be in the upper 70s already by 9. We'll see some clouds throughout the day, and eventually this afternoon, our highs are going to jump back into that triple digit range. We're also still watching for the potential for some flooding throughout the Sierra with a flood watch in effect again this afternoon.